these guys. I'll be with you in just a second. <clears throat> ah. I hope Ryan doesn't turn the camera back on me anytime soon. Uh, <laughs> I have come up with an unconventional way to sit right now. Terrible angle, but I should be able to uh, still get you in guys an idea of this match. Coffee Bug doing a fantastic job so far, but that's the thing about Fox. He's doing a fantastic job until he isn't. And, yeah, I mean, they're going back and forth. It's just very much the sort of state of this game. And very interesting, we're seeing the Pyra at this moment in time. Pyra, of course, she's slow. She can kind of get overwhelmed by Fox. Just look at this. Yeah, not able to get him off of her. Reads the, ooh, did not read the air dodge to the, towards the stage, though. Now, Coffee Bug, though, look at that. This is, ugh, it's so tricky. I feel like Mithra is generally a pretty good character against Fox, just because she has the speed to, ugh, to keep up. Dang, that's just death. Uh, but generally has the speed to keep up, and then still can edge guard. Like, normally one of uh, Mithra's weaknesses is that she doesn't exactly have kill power, but Fox is a character that notoriously can struggle to get back to stage. So, very interesting that we've only sim pretty much <clears throat> almost exclusively seen the pirate. Even at these, uh, yeah, these at higher percents, though, I guess, you know, whoa. Oh, at least you take Coffee Bug down with you. But that's not really the ideal way to do it. All right. Here comes Mithra once more, just getting in the damage. Just tiny hits here and there, though. It's not, it, it just racks up percent very effectively, is the thing. And I feel like a lot of characters, they, oh, oh my god, are you dead? Oh, that almost killed Yeesh. Gonna be making it back to stage, but 107%. This is honestly, I think just stay, stay Mithra. Yeah, just stay Mithra here. I liked the idea behind that. Oh, no. Yeah, like as soon as the switch to Pyra comes out, the fact that <laughs> your frame data is less good, you just kind of get tossed around. Kind of a bad point to do it. Anyway, that's gonna be game one for Coffee Bug. Uh, looks like they're communicating about where to go next. We'll see, though. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, mm, I agree with this, I suppose. Uh, definitely. Ah. Now, admittedly, Pyramithra, is, they're a good enough character that you shouldn't necessarily feel switched off because of the character's weaknesses. I do think that perhaps just staying more with the Mithra could have been could have been effective. But at the same time, Dusty of course, has a Joker, and this Joker is pretty dang good. And so we'll see if it will pay off already doing much, much better. Yeah, Joker is a character that basically has that sort of Pyra Mithra, uh, except it's, on the one hand, it's not on demand. You know, you basically have to get Arsene, which that's the equivalent to Pyra in terms of kill power. Uh, but once Arsene does come out, you don't have to worry about being slow. Yucky! Uh, I didn't even know what percent that back could kill that, but it was not a lot. And, oh man, working out so well. And the fact that that side beat connects, it, it amounts to so much damage just because of the damage over time component to it. But there goes Arsene. Not really. Ooh, okay. Uh, here's the thing. Fox can also, hey, uh, his kill power is weird. He gets a lot of kill setups, so many of them. But if you're able to properly avoid those kill setups, especially the ones that are really only mix-ups, you can survive to some pretty decent percents, especially because he doesn't necessarily have a clean answer to shields. He can grab you, but look at that. Forward throw at the side of the stage at 154, and he just gets lightly tossed off. Oh, the first hit, it looking like really smashed the guy right there. Only the first hit of Fox up there connecting. That's really bad for uh, Coffee Bug. 
forward tone, pulling me even further off there. I just want to point out also, okay, he's dead. That was a really, really important death, by the way, because uh, Madosti was about to get Arsene again. <laughs> oh, yo, okay, holds on to his jump, though, and actually turns it around. Oh, Coffee Buck was almost so cool, but he dies for it. This is what being cool gets you this day and age. I, yeah, you have to remember that he can hold that down. And because he did, it gave him Arsene all the way. Look at this. And granted, Coffee Bug's only at 29%. Uh, 42 now. Oh my god, why was I, why was I not worried for Coffee Bug? This is actually terrifying. But we do have, alright, it looks like Arsene is going to be taken out without, uh, yeah, Coffee Bug really suffering for it. But this is another thing, is that just like how Mithra can get these... Yeah, yeah. Just like how Mithra can get these edge guards onto uh, Fox and ha doesn't necessarily have to worry about the fact that normally lacks kill power. What? Well, that was kind of cool. Did they trade there? Is that what happened? That was kind of a funky looking play. But anyway, that's going to be Madosti taking game two. The switch to Joker absolutely working out for him. And... Honestly, we're going to need, see, need to see some adjustments from Coffee Bug because that was pretty decisive, especially because when our Sen came down, for that first stock especially, second stock was a little bit better, but the first stock, Coffee Bug didn't really respect it. You have, have to fear the bear. You have to just understand the risks involved with engaging in the man when he's got the ghost behind him, or whatever the heck our Sen is. Uh, <laughs> I wonder if... Uh, Madosti should ever just start off with counter because foxes love to go for laser right at the start of the game because you get like four or five percent normally like people don't it just happens but if you counter first that's like nah I don't know how much our send charge that is but it's not a, not nothing all right things looking a little more even this time around but yeah this is the sort of thing where oh okay uh Joker combos are going to work pretty well on Fox. Oh, and here comes Arsene. He's going to respect it. Oh, my God. He's so lucky he didn't die right there. And no, oh, the damage keeps coming. Oh, you are dead. Once again, as soon as Arsene came out, just within the span of 15 seconds, Coffee Bug is just in the ground. And I understand, you're a Fox player, you know, you want to you press forward, because pressing forward is very fun. But you have to press forward in very smart ways. Uh, that was great, that was fantastic. Recognized and remembered what happened to him in the last game where he went for that up there too quickly and gave Madosti a ton of armor, uh, a ton of uh, Arsene charge. The thing is, though, that it is laggy if you wait for the very end of it, so you have to look to see when he is going to drop that mask from his face. And once he does, yeah, that's a fully charged forward smash. Good stuff to Coffee Bug. Let's see if he can take that uh, swing momentum and really bring it to a game victory here. Things are pretty even, but ooh. Okay, here's here's very decisive moment. We have Arsene once again for Madosti. Can Coffee Bug survive this time around? Oh, that spot dodge was so crucial. And oh, he's reading these spot dodges though. Good stuff to Coffee Bug. The thing is, he needs to convert it into a stock, honestly, and he falls out of it. What was that? Maybe that's because like, of Joker's thin frame. I don't know what that But, oh, what? Uh, he even got the jab reset. Uh, he should be recovering from this. Yep, 131%. We're not going to be seeing Arsene again from Madostian. Yeah. That up smash. Keep in mind, that up smash is how he won the last game. And we're seeing fantastic adaptation from Coffee Bug. Knowing that he's going to look for an up smash uh, in that particular situation, he's able to bait it out and punch with forward smash. And that's also another thing is that a lot of times people will, um, they'll be very eager to, oh, this is actually really big. Hold on a second. Arsene just came in. Chances are Coffee Bug is going to die. However, that means that Arsene is, there's a very good chance it won't be in play when it comes time for Coffee Bug to be at high percent on his last stock. All right, yeah, there it is. But you can see, just stay on the platform. Uh, okay. I mean, that too. Yeah, I am. You took 59%. You could have just waited on the platform. <laughs> I'm just saying.
All right, this is a dead even game right now. Madosti at only 88, but there are still things that Fox can do that can kill up smash. Any link into up smash will do it. Any type of falling neutral air, down air if it links into it properly. So there are things that that uh, Madosti definitely has to be scared of. At the same time, Coffee Bug, even though it's going to be a while before Arsene proper shows up, that was good though. Yep, yep, yep. Good stuff to Coffee Bug. Keeping his mind with it, and he was looking for that down air, finally lands it, and he had just anticipated that tech roll away, and he reads it with the forward smash. So, <clears throat> good stuff to both players, but it's going to be Coffee Bug.